What up, Pisces gang? It's your girl, Amber777, here today with your almost daily love reading. I hope you guys are doing super fantastic. I certainly am. Let's go ahead and jump right in, guys, okay? Holy angels and spirit guys, give me clear, concise messages for my Pisces family. My Pisces soul family. It's gonna be for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. As you know, it is general, right? So take what resonates, leave the rest, keep an open mind, open heart about what does come out, right? And cross watchers, you know, put yourself where you belong in the story. Okay, now click that like button, guys. Okay, go ahead and support your girl so that this video can circulate to those who need it as well. Click the subscribe button if you have not. Okay, I do upload for you guys quite often, so click the subscribe button and the notification bell. And let's go ahead and get to it then. I'm done running my mouth now, y'all. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Now, look, what I will say is my mind was going a thousand miles per hour during your meditation, okay? It wasn't quiet, okay? It, it was just going and going and going and going. I don't know if you are feeling chaotic in your energy or if this is your person. Um, I was very, it was very unsettling, okay? So there is someone who feels extremely unsettled in what has happened or what is happening in the connection or what may happen, right? Like the unknown. Um, I don't know who that is. Meditation would certainly help um, so that you could stop fucking up my meditation. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Um, okay, so I'm pulling a few cards from the Energy Oracle deck, okay guys? Wow, yeah, you can't make, wow, 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 wow. Okay. So this is why I was feeling that way. So we have the seven chakra, right? So it's your crown chakra, guys. All right, so this is something that you were getting intuitively from spirit, that there's some sort of betrayal. This is something that you could have already found out, but a lot of you are intuitive yourself. You, you are light workers or intuitives yourself. Um, you don't have to know directly what the fuck is going on to know what the fuck is going on, okay? All right, now. There is somebody who does not necessarily know that you are enlightened. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's not that they think that you're ignorant to the fact that they're doing some dumb shit or some fuck shit, but they don't necessarily know everything that you already know. You might be playing stupid with this person, aren't you? <laughs> you like, I play dumb just to see how dumb these motherfuckers are. Like, that's what I do. Okay. Um, this I don't like, guys, okay? So you need to be very careful. I think this is something that you are already fully aware of, though, okay? I think I'm going to clarify this in the extended just to be sure, but there is someone who has been very deceitful. There is someone who has been doing things just to get away with murder. Maybe they are, um, this may be a person who wants to get back, right? It doesn't necessarily have to be your love connection. This could be um, friends, family, anybody who is in your energy sphere, okay? It could be several different individuals. You know that sometimes these cards popping up can just be a energy that is surrounding you in particular right so i'm just getting like this download for you to just be very mindful of your circle of people i feel like you already keep a close-knit a really tight circle but you're tightening that circle even more so like one other person or some shit you know what i'm saying that's no longer a circle that's a pair okay that's a pair you're moving in complete and utter silence and you've gotten these downloads to do that right you're making money moves for sure okay if you are not you will be getting downloads to start doing that there's some sort of opportunity okay so this is your message just take that um wow i do not like that deceitful card this is somebody who is in your energy this could be somebody who is smiling in your face right like quite literally pretending to be something that they're not somebody that they're not trying to deceive you they could be trying to get something out of you they could be trying to um possibly hurt harm you you know what i'm saying not physically but like emotionally you know how people like to come in and trigger you knock you off balance um because you know, our lives are like a domino effect, right? So if one aspect of your life feels fucked up, whether it's in love or finances, it just ca it just kind of pours out into the rest of your life. So this could be somebody trying to knock you off balance in some way so that you can't get to this bag that I already heard in the beginning, guys, okay? So be very careful, be very careful. Okay, let's see what else we have here. Oh, <laughs> somebody is sad. That's why I heard all, guys, okay, so is this you? No, this is not you. This is them, they said. All that mouth to go with them tears, huh? Okay, so somebody talks a whole lot, guys. They ain't saying shit. They are losing their shit right now, however, okay? This is, I do feel this deceit card showing up in this as well, though, okay? I'm just gonna have to say that. Um, I feel like 
This is someone who is trying to put on as if they're okay. They're cool. I'm good. Like, I'm good. Like, it, this could go either way and I'm straight. But they're really inside. They're throwing shit. You know what I'm saying? They're throwing shit around. They're breaking shit. Um, they possibly want to continue to save face so they can't emotionally overreact. But they may be planning to do something else to kind of trigger you, okay? Wow. <laughs> see I can't I can't deal with this I cannot deal with this okay so this is a victim guys okay all you did was love this person let's be very clear you didn't steal shit they're viewing you as the deceitful person they're viewing you as the one who came in and made them love you like how dare you how dare you make me fall in fucking love how dare you like I don't fall in love I just I do me you know what I'm saying I play this game the way it needs to be played and this is what they feel you've done that you've come in you've stolen their heart they want it back this is why they were showing up in this fucking meditation y'all it's not a lie okay it's not a lie yikes um if you've never known this person to be the type to be extremely emotional that is the case for some of you they are they are they they have had some tears okay they might not have been a full it might not have been a full-blown ugly cry but there was definitely like a tear or two you know what i'm saying even if it was like a tear that they stifle you know how when you feel yourself about to cry and your mouth start turning downward and you almost can't control it like your ducks get all full with tears and shit and you just take like a couple of deep breaths and it goes away that's exactly what i'm feeling guys wow <laughs> Like, I'm a G. I don't cry over this shit. Fuck it. Fuck it. Wow. Yeah. And this is why, guys. Okay? This is a person who was definitely untruthful to you guys. Okay? I'm just going to say that. This is quite possibly someone who tried to make it seem like they did not have love for you like they they could care less you know what i'm saying and their actions made you feel that way too it's like oh okay i mean if you are acting as if you don't love me and and the shit that you've been doing the, shit, the way that you've been behaving certainly says that as well so what else am i to believe but somebody is lying guys and this could be somebody who actually told direct lies to your face wow why the fuck are you here? Hmm? Why are you here? Pisces already knows, okay? Pisceans already know. They already know, okay? So sit your ass down and listen for a second. Even if you did not tell them directly that you were full of shit or whatever it is that you've done, whatever deceitful behavior you have brought about in their life, they already knew, okay? They're protected. Wow. So now along with everything it is that they had to say this person could have said some really nasty things to you guys okay hurtful things you know what i'm saying this is somebody who is trying to trigger your tears trying to tr trying to trigger your emotions um emotional wounds and stuff it's backfired you know what i'm saying now with all of that mouth all they have is their own pool of tears you know what i'm saying now they want to now they want to talk about you know what we are you know have you ever been to France, darling? I mean, what the fuck are you talking about? Like you was never, you were never speaking about a we before. You know what I'm saying? It was always about you. It was always about you, okay? Wow, I just heard a song by her. Y'all know the uh, singer, Her? It's called You, I think, right? Oh, it's called S? I mean, it's called U.S.? Us? It could be U.S. <laughs> Follow me, guys. Go look up the lyrics to a song by the singer her and i think it's called you though right it's like it could be us like us there's so many letters between the two of us between our names but it's always you you know what i'm saying it's always about you it could be us but it's always you wow and now they want to talk about we now this motherfucker speaks french okay all right all right all right all right maybe maybe they purchased rosetta stone i don't know y'all i don't know i don't know but you know what i do know your crown chakra definitely tapped in and gave you some downloads to let you know that whatever is happening here was going to either stagnate your growth or completely break down the motherfucking elevator. So you had to get the fuck off. You had to get off, the, you had to get out of that building, guys, okay? It was a burning building. It was it was inevitably going to be a disaster. You had, cause this is the only, this is the only option for you at this point, okay? You may be focused entirely and fully on the bag right now. I did hear that at the beginning. You have like some sort of opportunity coming in financially, and that is your full, focus some sort of project some sort of investment 
I don't know. If you have not experienced this yet, you will be. This is the focus, okay? All the way to the top, baby. All right? We're not staying on ground level anymore. And this is somebody who tried to humble you guys. Okay, I'm just gonna say this. They always knew you was going up there. They always knew that you were going all the way up. But they had to, I don't know, make themselves feel good, right? So how do you do that? Well, you start telling lies. Lies like we're on the same level. Lies like mm, I'm too good for you. Lies like I don't give a fuck if we're together or not. They're all lies, guys, okay? This is somebody who's believing their own fucking lies. I mean, this shit is just dumb as fuck. I'm just saying. And now they speak French, okay? They want to know what's up with us. What's going on with, with you and I? Are, are we a thing anymore? And you like, uh, no, motherfucker, I'm not even in your building anymore. Like I'm in the, like you can't, you don't even have the credentials, okay, to get where I'm going. All right, you don't. Wow. So there will be a lot of persistence, guys, okay? I'm just gonna say that. I know y'all tired of old people showing up, but I'm just saying, they feel like you have, like a thief in the night, deceptively, deceptively, okay? and involuntarily stolen their fucking heart. And how dare you, okay? How dare you just disappear and now I can't stop thinking about you. I can't stop focusing on what has happened, what will never be, what you may think of me now, right? This is somebody who now is, now, now they wanna think about what you think. <laughs> wow, 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 wow. This is the plea. This is a plea deal. <laughs> they like, can I just take the plea deal, judge? Don't put, don't give me life. Don't give me life. This is a person who knows that they will be in a mental imprisonment if you will not have this conversation, if you will no longer see it to work on this again, okay? Now don't beat me up talking about, girl, well, we ain't fucking working on this. Are you dumb? Then you just say that the crown chakra said, I did, I'm just saying. They know that a mental imprisonment is what they will be, they will be written to that for the rest of their lives, okay? All right, it's almost like somebody who had like a diamond and they thought it was like a pebble, so they just kind of skipped it across the Pacific Ocean, you know what I'm saying, and watched the water ripple. And then somebody was like, that was a diamond, asshole. They was like, oh. Okay, after it's already gone. Uh-oh. Wow, they never deserved it. That's what it is. So this is someone who did not have an eye. They didn't have an eye for, for your beauty, for, for your worth. You know what I'm saying? They couldn't see it, all right? Um, they didn't have an eye for the, the quality in which they had within this relationship, guys, okay? Wow, I can't, I can't deal. I cannot deal with this. I can't deal with this. I can't deal with this. I can't, I can't. You are protected though, okay? So you're gonna continuously be receiving those downloads, all right? Especially when this person starts to approach again. Um, you might make this person cry. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not laughing, y'all. I'm not laughing. I just know, I just know, okay? Pisces is one of my favorite signs. I know y'all like the back of my hand. Y'all don't play. Very, very sweet individuals, okay? I mean, loyalty like, like no other, all right? The energy is unmatched, okay? Once you meet one, you will never unknow what a Piscean is like, okay? It's, it's like no other. However, 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 <laughs> the fish can turn into a shark real quick, you know what I'm saying? Bite motherfuckers' heads off, okay? All right, you will drown in the abyss when you start thinking that there is not levels to this to this loyalty to this sweet energy oh that can change real quick it can flip it can flip motherfucker it can flip okay and then you're wounded <laughs> down in the abyss in that ocean with the fucking diamond that you threw down there dummy like i feel like you're gonna make them cry some of you if this is your story this is your story this is why it says that because i feel as though this conversation um, you have to give somebody time to change, damn. Like, I mean, it's almost like an entitlement of some sort of somebody who feels as though, ooh, all of these cards are blue. I'm gonna try to stay on the same track, guys. I'm just hearing this intuitively. Yeah, this is somebody going through the blues, y'all. All of these cards are fucking blue, except this one, except this one, except yours. Purple, 
color of the crown chakra, okay? So you are very intuitive. You're gonna make, somebody's gonna make this person cry. And it is in reference to this conversation that they're gonna try to have about patience, about giving them time to change. Wow. Um, if they come back in trying to butter you up, you know what I'm saying? Um, you will call their bluff, okay? Somebody motherfucking lying. Somebody lying. You're lying. You're a liar. Um, okay. You never, you never told a truth in this relationship, let alone in your life. That's what your mama told me. That's what your mama said. You know what I'm saying? If your mama called you a liar, what else was to call you? <laughs> oh God. <laughs> wow. So they will go on the defense after that guys. Okay. They're going to get a lot of mouth when they are met with rejection rather than the loyalty you've been showing thus far. It's a very different character. Whose alter ego is this? They don't know this part of you. They never seen this part of you before, but you did warn them. You did, you did. You told them you were a great white. Like, I will rip your fucking head off, you know what I'm saying? I know I look like a cute little goldfish now, but please, please don't fuck with it. Oh my gosh, wow. <laughs> yeah. But they can't help themselves, guys, okay? This is their most current feelings. They are extremely burnt out, energetically, in their mind. It's, they are wounded, right? They are burdened by what is to come, you know? They wanna give it one final push. They wanna keep going, they have to. They wanna get out of this feeling of disgust. You know what I'm saying? I feel like they may have had some conversations with like friends or family. If you've met their friends or family, like what the hell did you do to Pisces? Like how the fuck you messed that up? Oh, you dumb. Oh, you are really dumb. You messed that up? Like, wow, wow. Can I shoot my shot now? <laughs> like I, I just, I'm hearing that. <laughs> Yikes. Which is only adding like salt in the wounds. This person is stressed the fuck out, y'all. I'm just saying. They are stressed out, okay? Subconscious habits affecting this, they give nothing, okay? We have the Ace of Pentacles in the reverse. There is no structure, there is no stability. This is somebody who wanted you to live in a house with them, yes, but it was made out of sand, you know what I'm saying? They wanna live in Disney World or some shit, right? Like, like unpractical ass shit is what they were wanting you to go for, all right? Um, this is not the type of person who was on a trajectory of prosperity. They didn't really have a prosperity mindset. So uh, subconscious blockages affecting this, or habits rather, is this person offers nothing guys okay it's subconsciously done though they do feel like when they come to this uh, to relationships that they offer so much like I give so much I do so much I have so much I you know this is the type of person who I mean when you have discussions with them about what they're giving or what they're offering they say a lot of stuff in those conversations but the only thing missing is the actual answer right like they can never really state what it, exactly it is that they're offering like what they're bringing to the table like there's they don't have a table you know what I'm saying so they're coming to your table but they're not bringing anything to that table either you understand okay so someone who wants you to kind of be hopeful about changes maybe sometime soon never you know what I'm saying like just this is the type of person who who patience is the ultimate ploy you know what I'm saying it's the ultimate request and if somebody will fall for it then I mean your patience will have to last like forever because the changes never come do you understand it's subconsciously done though this is not the type of person who will who will readily admit that they that they are not offering anything okay I just want to clarify this ace of pentacles is what they're saying okay I'm going to use the inversion tarot deck please clarify this ace of pentacles from a pisces so they're offering nothing they ain't offering shit you see what i'm saying so look guys this is what they say they can offer i mean it sounds great ten of pentacles i mean that's a fucking empire you know i mean that's the ultimate offer that's the ultimate stability the ultimate security the ultimate it's a very very practical type of energy and somebody who 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 talks a good game about getting this done never know mind you but behind it all quite literally, but right behind it is the Ace of Pentacles in the reverse. They can never quite get it off the ground. You know what I'm saying? They, they talk a great game, but somebody motherfucking lying. You know what I'm saying? Somebody's lying, okay? I think that it gave you pause also. Like when this person would talk about 
um, the things that they plan to do, not just in this relationship. This is the type of person who um, they don't really follow through on their goals and stuff like that. You did have pause about some of the shit that this person said that they would be able to get done. You did. You questioned it. OK, but it's like, let me not be like that. You know, let me just let me see what they can do. And what you saw was they can't do shit. They don't do shit. Wow. Which was ultimately slowing you down, guys. OK person would have remained on the first floor forever forever the ace is a start of a new cycle it's starting right it's a start of a new cycle and it's a start to manifesting abundance it's like gifts and prosperity um it's it's going towards like new financial opportunities and thinking about legacy, et cetera, et cetera. So is the 10 of pentacles. Their ace of pentacles is quite frankly in the reverse. They don't know that though. They don't know. They don't know. They don't know that their mindset, their actions and everything is literally sabotaging their growth and they don't mind taking people along with them on the ride to nowhere you know what i'm saying they want they want somebody to ride with you know they want somebody in the passenger seat you know riding with them no ac no insurance you know what i'm saying no air in the tire they just want you to be a rider you know and this is your this is your mindset so i mean it, it's it's not equally yoked it doesn't make sense so i mean as a Pisces, this shit has to make sense now. You're not just about to just go <laughs> blindly riding with somebody. But the second you notice that y'all are somewhere you're not comfortable, you know what I'm saying? And they don't care that they riding on the rim of their tire. It's like, uh-uh, let me out of here. Fuck that. Let me out. Let me out. All right. So how do they truly plan for things to go then? What was this plan? What was, what was the plan? Oh yeah, okay. So guys, <laughs> the plan was for them to act and behave and remain truly single while simultaneously having all the benefits of being in a relationship. You see what I'm saying? Say that I want the 10 of pentacles, say that I can afford that and provide that and we're on the same track, but not really offer exclusivity, not really offer a relationship, not really offer anything actually, but feign, you know, <laughs> the behaviors of somebody who is cultivating just about to offer something i'm just i'm just on the brink of offering something right and hoping that whoever it is that they're dealing with will keep that false hope right so that it can go on forever and then uh, before you know it you just realize you never got that right very very single-minded individual they do like abundance and happiness but they like that to be given from other people and they will give it to themselves but they don't they don't share the wealth you know what i'm saying this is the type of individual who likes freedom you know they like to be rewarded but they don't like they don't like to do anything for the rewards now <laughs> They want free rewards, okay? Wow. That was the plan all along, guys. I just have to be very honest about that. I think you already knew this, though. You did. I mean, come on. You get, you are in direct communication if you know it or not, okay? Um, you may vividly remember your dreams. You may um, have something in particular in a commercial that randomly jumps out at you and gives you some sort of insight towards something um somebody may just tell on themselves i don't know whatever it is it's like a you have like a direct line okay you got jesus on the main line all right you got spirit in the universe on the main line they can let you know what is happening without any of these other people or this person i feel like there are several individuals though guys deceptive energies in in your life in your hemisphere but you are protected like you have a main line to it but and you can catch it right before it happens wow Wow, 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 wow. So what is the lesson that the universe is sending their way? Please tell us. Oh, I need to be nosy. We'll look at their karma, okay, and the extended. I'm going to take their lesson from Moonology deck, though. Let's see what lesson from the universe is currently approaching this person. What lesson is currently approaching this person? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there is no pay day without work, motherfucker. There is no rewards without efforts, without doing anything. You don't get recognition for nothing. Like, okay, okay. If all you're blowing is hot smoke, then dust. I mean, that's what you get, right? Uh, I don't know, y'all tell me, okay? This is the lesson coming their way. Hard work, your hard work is paying, is paying off. 
the way that I read that is this person may, may have to sit back and watch not just you, but other friends and family in their in their atmosphere and their energy reap benefits of what they've sown okay this is almost like that you reap what you sow type of card so what have you sown if you if all you've sown is negative energy burdensome energy fucking up people's energy taking taking and more taking i mean what you think you're about to get back somebody please tell me okay but this is not the type of person who really deals with logic you know what i'm saying logic doesn't really logic doesn't really lie within this person's uh thoughts you know what i'm saying they don't they don't operate out of logic. We already know that. Wow. All right, guys, let's go over to the extended. I'm gonna see what karma this person is currently facing. I wanna know, I wanna know right now, okay? I also wanna see what their intentions moving forward will be, okay? Has it changed? Because I definitely feel like this is the type of person, especially from what I heard in your meditation, they feel like they just threw a rare diamond into the ocean, okay? And before they could go back and get it, it was gone and then that is exactly the point when they realized what exactly they had done okay so let's see if their intentions moving forward have changed i also want to see what their next steps and best possible outcome would be if you stay or deal with this or if you leave and go in the opposite direction it's been quite a while since i've done a new love reading for you guys so i'm going to do a new love reading in the extended all right we're going to see what or whom is coming in for you how will you know if this is if this person is worth your time all right why are they single assuming that they are single we're going to make sure they are y'all okay i'm going to spy on this person a little bit and I want to see what the potential of this going all the way to union, if that's what you want. What is the potential of that happening? Is this your person? Let's see. I just want to know, okay? We will also look at your spirit messages. Um, blockages that may be prolonging union with your divine counterpart. What rewards? I want to look at some good stuff. What rewards, good shit, beauty for your ashes do you have to look forward to in the near future? Okay, it's deserving. And we're going to look at your finances, of course, okay? So what do you have to look forward to in your next cycle financially? Only good stuff. Any blockages, if there are any, what blockages may be there that might be stagnating your growth and what you can do to fix that, right? So we can get that together. And then we're gonna look at advice from spirit directly of your focus or next move to guarantee financial success in the least amount of time. Okay guys, so go ahead and click that like button, click the subscribe button and the notification bell, don't forget. And come on over with your girl, let's cut up a little bit. It's gonna be linked down below in the description box. See you over there.